it is exactly the kind of contradiction that is typified as five-nation tour of Asia, and left many observers scratching their heads. But what can we decipher about the U.S. president's approach? Donald Trump is likely to return home and say he has had a great trip to Asia. There are some in the region who may agree that it has been of massive benefit, but not necessarily to America. Trump trades short and fat barb within Korea's Kim. Trump, Putin and I had good discussions. Trump and Xi offer competing visions for trade. The U.S. president has certainly been treated like a king everywhere he has gone, and it is obvious that he loves being feted and flattered, perhaps especially now, given all the criticism back home. In a foreign land, it is clear that if you treat him like royalty, he will behave like a polite guest. He has steered clear of nasty uncomfortable things like human rights and democracy. And of course, we know that it does not take much for the statesmanlike conduct to fall away if the bear is poked.